Alamaha. With this Pleiadian light greeting, I welcome you from the bottom of my heart. Today I share a channeling with you, a channeled message from the Pleiadians. The Pleiadians are our star siblings, our brother and sisters from higher dimensions. And I have asked them for an answer, an answer what CERN is all about. CERN is an European organization for nuclear research. And I asked, did the Big Bang really exist? Did the Big Bang really take place? And I received a very surprising information and answers. Ella Maha, we greet you from the space of unconditional love, light and in eternal connectedness. It is not a coincidence that the CERN experiments are getting so much attention right now. They basically reflect your own inner process of transformation. From our higher level, as part of the greater whole, we not only see the structure of existence itself, but our understanding goes far beyond what is possible with your scientific technologies. CERN basically stands for your own inner search, for who you are and where your origin lies. CERN is the attempt to open portals into other levels of consciousness which you basically can only open within yourself. Don't be afraid of their ideas of parallel realities and wormholes because the scientific experiment they are doing is not really important compared to your personal possibilities as a creator being. Because no one else can manipulate your reality, no one else can change your timeline if you don't agree with it. Everything you experience on the material plane originates on a subtle plane level and that reflects your own truth. It is an expression of a negative or positive belief system and it is the same with CERN. CERN exists on an energetic, etheric level as well as on the astral level above. There CERN exists completely neutral as an expression, an idea, a desire of your collective aspiration to experience and discover more of yourselves, to understand yourselves in your true essence. And how you experience CERN in physical reality, whether in a negative, destructive way to manipulate and to keep you down or in a positive way that helps you to learn and to understand more and more about your own nature, it is up to you. Because what you believe in, you will experience. All things you reject in your life and where you are in fear and resistance will become destructive. The idea of a Big Bang, a Big Bang that created the universe and expanded outward explosively is not really true. Your scientists, they still do not understand it because basically it was an implosion, a collapse 
of the one inward in a very special way. Because the greater one has divided into infinite parts of the one, which you also call God particle, the smallest particle, the substance of everything that is. Each of these God particles is holographic and carries everything of the greater one in itself. And everything that can be experienced is built upon this God particle. But this implosion inward is something very special, because basically there is only one God particle which reflects and mirrors itself in manifold, infinite ways. This gives the impression that there are an infinite number of independent particles. But this happens and exists outside of space and time. Therefore, this one God particle can make all other God particles appear simultaneously in its reflection as present and existing. But basically, there is only this one God particle. There is no empty space, because there is nothing outside of God. There is nothing outside of consciousness. Everything is filled with information, frequency and life. Therefore, you are a unique expression too of this divinity that you express which you find within yourself and which does not exist outside of you and you are completely free to express this divinity within yourself there is nothing outside of God and that's why you are never alone you are part of the ocean of life itself and the God particle vibrates within you. You carry God within you. You carry your home, your origin within you on your unique journey through time and space. The God particle is you. It is poor love itself. You are never foreign. You are never false. You are life itself in its unique expression. We see you. We love you. We are with you. We are always connected in unconditional love. Meta na o usa e maka tiamate onota ishiya maka.